It's been one month since the Creative Studio began, and this will be the first update. Let's start with how the primary goal has been met. And that is making me feel nice for seeing how much better I am as a writer than all the rest of you plebs. The secondary goal is not going as well as I expected, because the participants suck and don't improve as fast as I imagined. But I don't care, because this is only making me feel even better because of the previous reason. Let me give you some statistics and clarifications for making you understand what is going on so far. Out of the 7,000 subscribers I had a month ago, and yes, there were 7,000 before I made fun of Miura's death, not, only 27 people joined the Creative Studio. That alone gets to show you how little people want to be creative. Anyone who writes crappy fanfiction automatically belongs in the special 0.01% of humanity who bothers to be creative. Fanfiction writers, you can feel vindicated about it, I sure do. By the way, the cutoff doesn't stop there, since out of those 27 people, half of them didn't even write a single chapter and gave up, and out of the rest, only 9 are still active after a month! That's right, only a third of them didn't give up after a single month, despite me helping them out by giving them a text to use and several tips for improving their craft completely for free! And even then, amongst those nine active writers, only half of them wrote more than one chapter thus far. Boy, does that make me feel good! Because I am someone who wrote a story that is several hundreds of thousands of words big, without anyone helping me out with a starting text. And now, let me show you what is wrong with rookie writers. These are universal issues everyone has to go through in his journey to be almost as good as I am. The first issue is learning how to write. Not writing well, just writing basic sentences and having a flow so one sentence follows the previous sentence. When you can't even do that, you get this jewel! Holy mother of god, what is this? You can't even read it! No grammar, no structure, no fleshing out! It's almost as bad as a light novel! Anyways, you can see how I bothered to correct him and gave him lots of tips for improving this trash fire. Because there is no such thing as an unsalvageable story. There is only a story that wasn't edited enough times. His response to my most useful tips that would make him a better writer without paying a cent was to give up. It wasn't something I said, it was him not being dedicated. And I feel so good about it because I can write sentences that make sense. The next issue after someone knows how to just write is learning how to flesh out his ideas. Because every idea begins as a summary and then expands to have stuff like world building, characterization, action and the like. Many of the participants didn't know how to take something that was basically an info dump that was either just narration or two characters flapping their mouths for 10 pages while nothing else is going on. So I told them several ways for improving the exposition or how to minimize it by adding in the characters doing something or looking at something instead of having to say it. Very basic stuff any rookie writer knows of and something Sean and Mangaka have no idea of how to convey without resorting to characters explaining what they are doing in the middle of a fight despite being goddamn obvious. Even this issue was enough to make many to give up or not knowing how to do it, despite being easily fixed by showing stuff instead of having to say them. It's another thing that made me feel nice, because I can do that! There were also those who only made slight edits of my story, like changing red eyes to blue eyes and rubies to sapphires. Those had no creativity whatsoever, because the point was not to do a slight edit of my story, it was about writing their story, by using my story as an aid. I have nothing but contempt about them, since I told them to make sure the story becomes different in the second chapter, and most of them gave up because they didn't know how not to parrot other people's ideas. And thus we are now down to 9 people, most of which are still stuck in their first chapter, trying not to make a slight edit of my work, and then trying to have something other than a huge info dump or people talking about what should be shown. The procrastination is laughable! A whole month and they hardly have a single chapter ready, despite having a text as an aid and someone helping them every day for free! Man, do I feel great about that! Nobody's motivating me to keep writing, and after years of daily grinding, I have several thousands of words with above average level of writing and a story that is not a slight edit of someone else's work. I am so much better than all of you! By the way, there is no deadline in the Creative Studio. If someone wants to join now, he can. 
And I'm still gonna be there laughing at his bullshit and feeling superior because despite helping him out for free, he will still be nowhere as good as I am. <laughs>